Hello everyone, this is the video number 7 and in this video we are going to cover <coughs> this automating this compose button that is I am going to click this compose button and set all these fields going to press this send button and log out alright <coughs> let's start and in the previous video we stopped till login to the email so, so now we are going to click this compose button this code is going to do that is going to log into this email id password and going to sign in and wait for 5 seconds alright so we will continue from this <coughs> so click on compose button click alright so should get say <coughs> right click inspect yeah this yeah this is the inspect element and uh, right click copy copy selector we go by our method itself it's paste when we paste here <coughs> it uses the backslash character i told you that there is a one percentage where this our method may not work if we use this backslash character into our code that time it this our code or this driver cannot able to find whether it is a backslash character or this idea of this element or, or is this something else so that time it's not <coughs> prescribed to use this method it's better to use brute force method as i told it before so or you can use xpath itself so let's use brute force so that it will be practiced for us let's make use of the division object which is bit higher in the tree structure let's i will take yeah, this thing this class name AIC is not the any class name of any other element I hope so let's try it it's a brute force right anyway let's try and get error and I think it's a class name right division and class name yeah so since it is a class name dot id yeah I got this element so it is highlighted here so let's make it a bit fast so yeah in this I need division of this highlighted class alright so I will go to this dot again yeah z0 let's try yeah got z0 again division I just said div yeah I got this I just copy this element I paste here the driver dot find element by css selector sorry by css selector in this i just paste and going to click right yeah now what once it is clicked we got to send it to this two element i just send email to my my email itself this is the email so set to yes, set to. so this is the element so here is the text area i know this is again using a special characters like colon and also that term this copy method may not work let's make use of a brute force because i <coughs> prefer brute force most of the time so that i am sure myself that whatever the css selector i am giving will be 100 percent success so i don't like to have a throwing a driver throwing an exception it's because of css finding css element so let's make the driver too easy to find the element what I'm telling. So let's make use of the division <coughs> object which is just above in the tree structure. Let's I will use of this OJ. It may work. Class I think. Yeah, I got and in that again division object I just use div because only one division is there, I think it will work. And so lazy to enter this class name dot w w0 so just give div since it is only one division object and it's default it will take the first element if you want to give a second element nth of type you can give and in this text area i just give text area all right then it will find and yeah this is the css selector of two object all right so driver dot find element by css selector 
dot send case I just copy and paste this email id itself so just send myself now set subject right yeah set subject again try over dot yeah. yeah now it's a time to find the CSS selector of this subject let's do it <clears throat> let's take this element itself because I am sure that A is zero, A O D and all it won't be used any other because it's just like random characters right feel it won't be used any other so I don't find any exception I feel let's try dot see null y because there is a space so space should be replaced with the dots yeah I got this element I want input just give input I'm just verifying once again in this console tab so that my programs will run without any error right find element by CSS selector by send case <coughs> what sending email start you sending email All right now yeah Now we send set, set something in the subject and now it is message now we will find the same procedure we will apply let's make it fast yeah <coughs> i'll make use of this class hope that it will work fine and dot and remember the space that should be replaced with the dots yeah i got in this again division is this the element right yeah this is the element let's try it out which element yeah, this element with the id ej yeah, okay let's make it's id right hash i think this special characters okay fine ej let's try if any of them any of them okay so screw them this is and is there anything inside nothing inside all right just yeah this is what we supposed to nothing is there inside this division so this is the root of the tree so it's better to give that as a css selector so set set message content all right so now driver dot find element by CSS selector paste dot send some keys <coughs> automating um, compose button scenario ok so we set something here and now it's time to press send button Let's do the same procedure for this also. I do the I use this division <coughs> tag which is just above the element in the tree structure copy here. Let's verify it again because in a huge program it may be a problem when scenario is failing because of CSS element. Alright. So in that division two I just use directly. Let's let's make this is the one right so, division class name yeah did I miss dot something is there or what should be highlighted right let's give just click let's try undefined okay let's try again right click inspect so it find sign okay division id let me use this class name directly let's see what happens if the driver is can able to find it which is what make sure it doesn't have any special character yeah it doesn't have hyphen is fine underscore is fine and it's a class name division class name so it should start from dots and paste and every spaces will be replaced with the dots 
let me have one more. Oh, still is a problem. Yeah, here. Why is the problem? Because I missed space here. Yeah, I got. Finally, I got. This is the CSS selector of send button. So now click on send button driver dot find element by css selector dot click yeah it's going to click the send button let's try it out once just run and see this is going to work as we think let's see yeah yeah it's loading and dot successfully compose yeah it's fixed and yeah it is and did it send it did it press send is there anything wrong yeah let's make the mistake unable to find element yes i knew that <coughs> so yeah what it's saying is no such element unable to locate the element this send button why why it could be because <coughs> this yeah i will stop this first let's make the mistake no problem so that we will understand much better basically let's make here yeah, inspect because if i give directly do it's not able to find this element into a tree structure because so it's deep into so so code is so big and <coughs> let's try something in some other way um, okay I, i will take one which is just above this it is encapsulated inside this yeah let me try to use this does it work let me try yeah it is working but saying nothing is there inside mm -hmm. let me try it with this tr tr with class them right yeah let's try tr with class name yeah i got and in this td first td in the type in the type one yeah and this div let's give big so that driver easily can understand and in this div second div i'll give here itself nth of type 2 so here div is this div and inside this division type there are second division i want all right so i just give div again div of nth of type 2 so it's giving send element just copy this css selector and what i want to say for each and every <coughs> specifying a css selector of an element there is many ways there are lots of ways there is as i found there are two ways there are maybe many ways we should give in such a way that driver can easily understand it so that driver may not be find tough to find an element it just throw an exception if it can't able to find it just sign now just send and once it is sent just we used to do click two more element sign out in order to sign out our emails that is the end of our tutorial let's see is it going to work fine or no yeah this is fine now right now two more element this so is it going to find out no? element i hope copy selector will work fine yeah hope there is no special characters and let's try it out why do we need to take risk right dollar dot click just click click yeah this is click okay let's copy or this click on lock on driver dot find element 
I see the character. Okay, it's it's actually good to nice. It's a practice, good practice to give such a huge CSS selector so that <coughs> driver easily can find this tag and this ID in three structure and just drill down easily and find the element what you are speaking. All right, and once it is this, I now button to be sign out. Let's say I know. Let's try. I think there is no special characters. Copy CSS selector. Okay, do we need to press this? Okay. I don't like to press because it will sign out and I can't, I need to log in again, so I don't like to do that. So, find element CSS by ID dot click and let's wait for two, two more seconds. So, driver dot manage dot so timeout dot implicitly three seconds to so that we can see whether it's successfully sign out or not so <clears throat> running yeah i hope it will run fine and this is the end of our tutorial <clears throat> and in the next video we will take some other example in this example we use just click 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 everywhere so there are so many things other than click or oh, what is happening Oh, yeah, unable to know such element because what happened? <coughs> the it was internet was a bit slow, so we gave some two or three seconds. So that time it may not able to load this page. It may not able to find this compose button. That time it's better to increase the sleeping time, or it's better to run one second and see what happens. Is it exactly because of the internet or something? Let's try it out. So <coughs> there are so many element. So many operations you can perform on the drivers like hovering or double clicking. We just learned click and send keys. All right. So let's. There are so many elements. Oh, it's still throwing error. Where it's throwing error? AI. Yeah, it is here. It was working fine. Let's give seven second and let's try it now. <clears throat> what I was saying is there are so many. Operation we can perform on drivers that's um, double click, hover, drill down, scrollable, so many things. So, we'll cover all those things into the upcoming videos. And yeah, it is running fine now. It is fine. I told you because the page was not loaded at all, and driver used to find this CSS selector in entire page. So, that time the element was not loaded. So, <clears throat> it's that time I don't. <coughs> appreciate if you use the uh, sleeping time it's better to use some other way i will explain in the next some upcoming videos so that what we want is we want to wait the program till this element loads so we will all those cover in the next upcoming videos so <coughs> have a nice time bye bye